guys, it's Emma here. So today I'm going to be doing a Midland Chandler tour again. If you hadn't seen my last one, I'll link it in the description box if you want to go and check that out. But today we are at Mercy Marina, the one of the big, the biggest marina in the in Europe or UK. Um, um, so this place is actually really cool. Ignore the geese that started making a lot of noise when I started making my outro, um, my, my intro. Um, so, you know, just taking all them. Uh, but this place is so cool. It's big, it's cool, and I just love it here, and it's just <laughs> amazing. Um, so, let's go. So, here is Midland Chandler's. Uh, this is the kind of like the fire area. So, there's kindling, there's fire cleaning stuff, there's actually fires and chimneys. Um, here is some electronics. So, there's TV, there's an aerial, I think. There's a bit more fire stuff here. Um, there's electrical wires and batteries I think yeah um, there's some lights horns for your boats when you go through tunnels or boats coming or something like that uh, oops down here is more electrical stuff there's actually a folding laundry basket which I find really cute and it's actually a really good say space saver um, which I really want uh, but we have quite a bit of stuff on the boat already and a lot of folding stuff so I don't think we can fit any more <laughs> in on our boat then we've got some Victoron energy stuff um, like some solars and some inverters and then there's a chair which I want but we have no space in our boat which I really wish we do because it's so comfy and it looks like the chairs we had in our house then we've got some like plumbing stuff like pumps, bilge pumps, portable pumps, um, I think that's like a water tank or chlorifier, I'm not 100% sure <laughs> about that. Um, then we've got some kitchen stuff, we've got some sinks, um, and then we are moving on to the toilets in a minute. But we've got some sinks up here, some faucets, and all that fancy stuff, which we don't really have that much fancy. Um, but it just looks so nice. <laughs> then we've got some toilets. We've got a porty potties. Um, these are kind of slightly different to a cassette. A cassette. Um, no, I don't think it's actually that different. It's just a different brand. Um, and then we're moving on to the actual cassettes, which we had when we bought the boat. Um, but we got fitted for a compost toilet. And then it got all the supplies for a thing. But they're actually really nice and really fancy. And I'm touching toilets, so... <laughs> Uh, then we've got some cookers, like a little hob. We've got refrigerators. This was actually the original refrigerator we were going to get on our boat, but it was too... We like I think the walls came in a bit too much in our boat, so we couldn't get it, um, so it was a bit disappointing. We did, we think we got... Was it this one? No, it was kind of similar. To, similar. Um, then we've got some ovens, cookers. We've got some sinks and some more cookers which are way nicer than ours then we've got these adorable fridges like look it has this and then it's just so cute and like retro and vintage i think and it looks so cute and we've got some super fancy things um like cooker things i'm gonna lift one up without breaking them oh no they're sinks oh okay <laughs> and then we've got some more cookers like little like port like they're kind of small then you've got some of these ones they're kind of smaller versions got some ovens then this is actually the cooker we have um this was we had to get a replacement i think it's like slightly different um but it's kind of similar to ours uh then we got yes some loads of ovens we've got some ropes over there which i'm actually going to be getting for some magnet fishing um i'll go over there in a minute let's go back down here um so go back down here uh there are more fridges and freezers i think there's some like eco gray cool box yep this is a very fancy cassette toilet because it has buttons. I'm not going to press them because I'll break everything. But they have buttons and it looks so fancy. And yeah, it's really fancy. So we just got some more cassette toilets. And we've got this ginormous like aqua blue thing that you put in your cassette. And it's so big. I don't even know how we would fit that on our boat. We've got a bathtub here, which is kind of cool. We've got a nice fancy little sink. And then we're back here. Let's go this way. Everything is so fancy here, but then we got some, well, I, don't, I think these are just for bits around the boat, I think you would just use. Um, yeah, I think these are just random little bits you'd use in your bow. Have we been down here? Oh no, yeah, we have, okay. <laughs> uh, then there's just a few more little bits. This is what you can attach to the outside of your boat so you can tie your rope around. Um, there are little like handles for things, so like if you wanted to open a cupboard or something like that. There are little hooks which you can 
might have a look at padlock i did actually try to fit we have like this padlock on our door which i tried to fit because i broke one obviously um so i actually tried to fit it and it failed so bad so we got like a bit of a rubbish one side padlock but then there's just a few more little piping and wiring and all that wiring <laughs> stuff then we got some porthole like things that go around your porthole um, we don't have any portholes, so we won't use these, um, but some people do. Uh, then we got some engine stuff. So we got, are these, what are these? Uh, it's a gearbox. Oh, it's a gearbox. Yeah, we got ours actually fitted in Banbury when I we broke down. I'll link the playlist in the description if you want to go and watch that. Um, but yeah, there's kind of like engine stuff you can use, like oil and everything. Going back here with some ropes and some more cookers. Um, you're definitely not short on cookers here. <laughs> some ropes that I'm definitely going to be using with my magnet fishing. Then we got an anchor, which we actually have an anchor and a chain. Um, then we have some, oh, I can't remember what these are called. Uh, they're like, you go at the side of your boat and you're blacking and then they collect everything. So the like the rest and everything doesn't go on your boat, which I think is pretty cool. Um, if you go chain on. Uh, down here is just some painting, then here we have some like netting nets that go on at the back and front of your boat. So, when you if you if you did ever clunk something or someone else clunked you, this would stop it from hitting your boat. And then we've got some like little clips. I, I want to say they're Jubilee clips. No, those aren't Jubilee clips. Okay, just ignore that. <laughs> Um, then we got some WD-40, my amazingness, and I have that and I use it every time I need to loosen something or to clean the solar panels. Uh, then we just got some tools here, uh, like screwdrivers and pliers and scissors <laughs> and all that stuff. Then we have some life jackets. This is a pretty cool looking life jacket. It's like fishes and stuff on it. It's just kind of cute. Uh, so we got some life jackets here. Then we've got is this like a lead for a dog oh cute it's a lead it's a lead for a dog oh that's cute okay that's cute i may get that one <laughs> it's even life jackets for dogs which is really adorable then these go on the side of your boat um which stop it from clunking like if you if a boat's going past you and they clunk you it'll stop it damaging um you can get netting versions of that then down here is just some cleaning supplies and then over here we've got some diaper pins some pins mallets some chains we actually have the chains but we haven't used them yet these like uh, are used to like those things over there things that you can put the side of your boat these can attach those if you have like a um, square holding bit at the top of your boat i don't really know what that's called we have a circle one so we wouldn't use these we've got some more pins we've got i don't know what that is um we've got some more pins then we've got some windlasses the collection of mainly of our boat i've got a lot i've got ratchet wind lasses i've got normal wind lasses i've got turny like the little things that kind of like these bits i've got a lot of wind lasses on our boat um then we've got yeah that's kind of it i think and we've also also followed them on instagram <laughs> and i think there's one more thing that i really want to buy but my mum won't let me because we don't have any more room but it does fold these i really want these they're so cool and i think the indie project have them um, but we can't buy it because we don't have more space for it. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, so I hope you liked this video. I had so much fun at Midland Chandler's and this place is just so cool. I definitely recommend you come here because it's just amazing. Um, so yeah, don't forget to give it a like, subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified every time I do a video. And comment on my social medias, my Patreon and my Gmail, thenightbrookgirl.gmail.com if you have any suggestions for me. So yeah, see you later. Bye.